Have you ever tried roasted potato with cadalini beans and tofu? If not, today you will learn a very easy, quick and easy recipe with these three ingredients. So just sit back, watch and enjoy and let's get straight into today's cooking. First, we're going to cut the tofu open with a knife or a scissors, whichever you prefer to use. And then we're going to drain the water from the tofu. I'm using the Tesco Firm Organic Tofu. Then you use some kitchen towels and you try to get as much water out of the tofu as possible. You know, tofu is preserved into water, so it's absorbed a lot of water. After which you put it aside, then you begin peeling your potatoes. And now is a good time for you to hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so before. And also let me know in the comment section where you're watching this video from. After peeling our potato, we get rid of the potato peels and then we'll be slicing our potatoes into thick round chunks. This is the size we're aiming to get. After slicing the potato, we're going to um, season our potato with a bit of salt, pepper, and I'm using a little bit of garlic, chili, um, olive oil. Then I add my salt and pepper to taste, a bit of garlic powder, a bit of red chili powder, and we combine together and put it aside. Now we go back to the tofu and we're just going to just break the tofu into small pieces. doesn't matter how you break them because we want it to break up in small tiny pieces. So you can look from the look of the plate, it looks like um, scrambled egg, which is what we're aiming to get. Then we're going to put our potato into a hair fryer. You can also use the oven or you can fry them on top but we want this, to, this meal to be as healthy as possible so we go ahead and use the hair fryer then we put our tofu into a saucepan as you can see no oil is added we just want to use the tofu on its own without no oil added to it and we're going to keep on stirring the tofu what we're aiming to do here is to get the tofu like scrambled eggs with those brown bits like you know when you scramble eggs is burning after which we season with a bit of salt and pepper or you can use whichever season of your choice in this recipe you can see it's getting a bit golden which is the perfect um, look that we are after look at this guys looks so nice and delicious already and there we had a little bit of um, garlic oil to it and we combine again this recipe is so quick and easy don't forget to share with your friends and family and also encourage them to subscribe to my channel on this channel we do a lot of meatless recipe even though I'm not vegan but I just love to make meatless recipe in the meantime we had the kalalini beans to a um, blender then we had a bit of coconut cream Then we squeeze half of a lemon. And add one um, teaspoon of crushed ginger. Then we're going to blend this until it's smooth and um, like a paste. This is the texture we're looking for. So now our food is ready. I told you guys that this was going to be a very quick and easy one. No time to waste in the kitchen. So now we're going to be serving this masterpiece up.
So now this is our tofu, which we're placing on top of the culinary beans. And look at that, guys. It might look dry, but the beans is all the sauce we need to enjoy this delicious recipe. After which, then we're going to be placing the potatoes on top of it. And voila, that is done. Look at those golden brown potatoes. This will literally takes you about 25 to 30 minutes, shouldn't be any longer in the kitchen. And then you go ahead and you drizzle with a bit of oil, it's totally optional, and garnish with some parsley. And there you go guys, we have a quick and easy roasted potato with kalalini beans and tofu. And it was yum. Those hands you see there, they are not my hands, that's my son enjoying this. Whatever I cook, he loved to be the taster in the house and he approved everything I cook. So until next time, guys, don't forget to share with your friends and family. Give us a subscribe. And if my channel is, some, is a channel that you really, really love, I wouldn't mind if you give us a membership join so you will be the first to notify when I drop a new recipe. God bless you and thank you for watching. Grab your fork, grab your fork and let's eat together this is really really yummy you can see this boy enjoying it